So I didn't have time this week to do a legit video. Um, life got in the way, work got in the way, just been too busy. So I didn't really have much time to do any filming and stuff. So I wanted to at least give you some sort of a video for the week because I'm trying to be as, uh, you know, up to date and um, consistent as possible. I'm doing at least one video a week, sometimes two. So I thought what I would do is uh, show you, this is in my office here, just show you video clip of me um, feeding some um, food to the planted tank back here. And what I'm gonna feed is the Sarah Onips. Um, these are something that Aquatic Support Systems does sell on their website. But in addition, I just think they're really great food. Um, you've probably heard a lot about them out on YouTube in the last few months. Um, and most people use them for what you see on here, and that's kind of smaller tropical community fish, which that's what I'm gonna show you. Um, I'm gonna show you right behind me um, some Cardinal Tetris feeding on them. But if you stay till the end, I'm also gonna show you what my favorite use for these things really is, and it's something that a lot of people probably haven't heard of or thought of, but uh, stay tuned and I'll show you what I've been using these for. Um, mainly and it's something that I'm really um, excited about. So if you're not familiar with the Sarah Onip or haven't seen them before, this is kind of what they look like in the bottle. They're just a little um, disc. They're, um, I'll dump a few of them out here um, on my desk, but um, they're just these little discs that are smaller than the size of a dime. Uh, they're like the size of a big vitamin pill or something like that. But anyway, you put them in the tank and as soon as they get wet, you can stick them to the aquarium glass. So. Um, thought I would just kind of show you guys uh, what they look like. All right, so thanks for sticking around to the end. Like I said, I thought I'd show you another use that I use these Sarah Onips for. You know, if you watch my videos, um, that I keep these large cichlids, uh, like this guy here, he's over 20 inches long. Um, this guy here, foot long, et cetera, et cetera. So you're asking, what would you use a Sarah Onip for? I could dump them in and they could devour them like the normal fish food I use. But no, what I do is I um, feed them in my fry tanks, actually. They make a real good fry food um, for fish that, um, 
you know, can't take a super big pellet yet. Um, so what you do is you just stick it to the glass and watch them go after it, just like those Cardinal Tetras that I showed you before. So I'll show you some feeding on my Midas fry tank right now. Um, but just thought I would show you another use. If you're into cichlids and you haven't heard of this food and you raise fry, check it out. We sell it at AquaticSupportSystems.com. Um, I think it's just a great food. Um, and I've been feeding it to my fry along with a few other things, but uh, check it out and thanks for watching.